So um, here's a little recording for a tip for how you can export uh, lots of different files to PDFs. I think in the long term this might make things easier to print and um, it's hopefully a lot fewer mouse clicks for you. So if you're in, let's say, hypothetically, a collection and you want to print everything in that collection, click on the top item and then press down the shift key on the keyboard. Well, let's click right here. So click on the top item on the checkbox, press the shift key down, and click on the bottom one. And you see how all of them are highlighted? You also, if you wanted to, could click one, two, three, four. But if you had a lot of different items, that would be harder. So I'm just unclicking everything, clicking one, pressing down shift, and clicking the bottom one. And then you'll notice that this little more uh, button pops up. If you click more or the down arrow, there's an option to download everything. So if you click download in your Google Docs, uh, I have one spreadsheet and three documents and I've chosen out of this list to uh, export them as PDFs or to download them as PDFs. So you have different options for the spreadsheet versus the document, but both can be PDFs. So it says four files to be compressed in a zip file and I can export up to two gigabytes at a time, which should be more than enough for you. So I'm going to click the download button. It says your files are being zipped. When completed, your uh, when complete, your download uh, will download. Then it says your download will begin shortly. If it doesn't start, click here. So I'm waiting for it, and it looks like it's loading. And here it's popped up, and I can choose uh, save file. I have slightly different options because I'm on a Mac, but I'm going to save the file, and then. Uh, we have the option to download it and you'll see that it downloads and then once it's downloaded uh, you can double click it uh, and it'll pop up I've double clicked it to unzip it because it starts as a zip file now it here's the whole file and I have four uh, different PDFs. You can see right here it says kind portable document uh, format I guess it would be and um, on a PC of course all of this will look a little bit different but the important thing is you shift click everything you export them uh, as PDFs then you find where you've download, downloaded them on your computer and then once you find where they are you can shift I've clicked the top one now I'm pressing down shift again to highlight all of them and I'm right clicking uh, just as you would on a PC and I can say open with preview on your computer it would probably say open with Acrobat Reader or something like that so I would open them here like this and it says that this is just a Mac thing so I'm not gonna explain it and then everything should open in preview this is another oh, okay so I have four documents that have opened. One, I guess that that's two, three, and four. And alas, with the um, the uh, Excel or spreadsheet documents, they're going to export with all the little gray boxes around. I haven't found how to export without that. But if that doesn't matter to you, then you have all your documents uh, in a program on a Mac like Preview or uh, on a PC like Acrobat Reader, and you can go to File, Print, or let's see. I've even selected all of them by shift-clicking, and it's not letting me print them, so I would just have to print them one by one, but it should be a, a shorter printing process just by clicking Print here and then the print dialog will pop up and you, you can print them like this. So hopefully that might make something easier, at least the exporting will be easier if not printing as a PDF. So let me know what you think, let me know if you have any questions and I'm going to cancel out of this print window but you would press print because you want everything to get printed. I hope this helps and uh, send questions if you have any.